Mic check, one, two, one, two. Mic check, one, two, one, two. Let's get it, baby. All right, so you already know what time it is. Let us know in the comments where you're from. Now, family, let's talk. Something happened today that really made me sit back and think. Now, before I even get to that, I want you to hit the like button. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. But we got to talk. We got to literally sit down and talk, right? Check this out. Somebody that I'm talking to literally right now, right, is literally throwing me off. I want you to really understand this. We can make money on the way down. Check me out. If you are not already in the Discord, please go ahead and do so. Because this is not financial advice, but this is education, mother, father, sister, brother. Now, what I want you to understand is to make money on the way down, you could buy what is called a put option. However, not every day you should buy a put, but not every day you should buy a call. And no one can tell the future, not a single person. But if you believe that people can, I promise you that you're going to get ripped off somewhere because somebody is going to try to upcharge you and sell you something for hundreds of dollars, sell you something for thousands of dollars, sell you something for crazy amounts that has you thinking that they could tell the future. To combat this, what I decided to do, particularly in the Discord, was say, you know what? Let's expand the way that we're thinking so that we know how to react if we start to see strength in the market or if we start to see weakness in the market. Take a look at this. This is the watch list from January 6th. Notice, and this is on the Discord. If you are not in the Discord, please go ahead and do so. Let me put the Discord link in the top of the chat. Because again, family, I'm telling you, I'm fun, but I'm not the one. And what do I mean by that? I mean, I laugh and I joke. But when it comes time to really get busy, we getting busy. And now it's time to get busy and it's time to come with the receipts and come with the facts so that you can know if you see strength on a play, what to do. If you see weakness on a play, what to do. So watch this. Check me out. Check me out. Because I, I can't believe some of, the, some of the things that I'm hearing. So watch this. January 6th. Notice today is the 7th. Today is the 7th. And I got this, the watch list. I didn't buy it yet. Because notice, it was 8.57 p.m. So what do we do? Take a look at this. I said I'm looking at, if we see strength, NVIDIA, on NVIDIA specifically. I'm looking at an NVIDIA call for 285. If it shows strength above, a specific down to the penny amount, 248.50. If I see it show strength above that, and what I mean by strength is the MACD lesson that I did earlier. I came on live and I showed you what to, what to look for with strength, with MACD and RSI. If I see strength, I show this. Now, what if I see weakness, though? Because nobody can tell the future. So now, let's say that you're waiting to get in on a call, but you're noticing that you're seeing weakness, right? What do you do then? You've been waiting for a call. Are you just going to wait and wait and wait and get into the call? Or do you say, oh, I'm seeing weakness. Why don't I get into a put, right? Check this out. I also combine that with, so I'm looking at a call if I see it over this down to the penny specific level. And then NVIDIA 275 put if it shows weakness under what? Under this 278.50, literally down to the penny level, family. I'm telling you, okay, I'm looking for a call here. If I see it here, I'm looking for a put if I see it here. So notice you look at NVIDIA. And it's trading, it goes, it starts all the way up at 284. Hmm, do we get a call? We don't know yet, right? Do we get a call? We're up at the 284 level. Do we get a call? Are we showing strength? That's why I put it in caps. Are we showing strength? Hmm, we're not showing strength up here. You look at the, at the MACD, like I was telling you in the video earlier, right? It was showing weakness, so we didn't get the call. It drops down. It drops down, it drops down, and then it gets to our levels. And notice, family, just following the guidelines, okay, I'm not seeing strength up here. I'm seeing weakness. 278.50, we started to see some weakness. I jumped in on live and showed literally step by step how to do it. How to do it because I wanted to show you step by step. This is what you do. This is how you look. This is how you get it going, right? So then on Discord Live, I showed you that I jumped in maybe in five minutes. Boom. I made 324, 27%. And then I jumped out. If I would have stayed in this put 
If I would have stayed in this put family, let's look at the receipts and let's look at the facts. When I posted it, the put and the call, but you see the weakness. Check this out. The put and the call, you'll see that we got 123, right? This this one ended up where? Let me just go and check, double check it for you because you know I got the receipts. You know I got the receipts. Hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up one second, fam. Let me just try to find, let me let me fix this real quick. Cause we, here we go, hold up. All right, we're good. So now look at this. It went up 134%, but I jumped out even before that because I took profit, straight up. I took profits because I don't want to be in a play too long. I tell you every time, it's better to be in it for, how can we put this? You would prefer to get out too soon than to get out too late. That's how you got to rock it out because you got to remember, like we were talking about, what we're trying to do in 2020. Two is build out a foundation and then trade out on top of it. Now, believe it or not, I'm getting criticism about telling people to build the foundation. Crazy, crazy, right? Crazy. Now, what's going to happen is you're going to end up being down 100% on your whole portfolio if you don't build that foundation. You got to understand it just like that. It's as simple as that. You see what I'm saying? Patience, having a foundation, having a plan to get in, having a plan before time. What will get you out? What will get you on a call? Straight up like that. Right. So now, again, what I want you to understand is that there is money to be made. There's money to be made. And I could have made more than this than the 324. I could have made three thousand. But I say, you know what? If I want to be consistent, I can't be greedy. Being consistent and being greedy, they don't work for a long time. You see what I'm saying? That's how we rock it out. So I want you to understand that there's so much money to be made now. Here's an issue. Here's an issue. Let's say that like when I was on a discord live and we we're talking about this, because I just want to be absolutely clear with you. Right. Check this out. Let's say that we. I'm on discord live. Notice that we're on live stream. So in real time, there's a lag. You see what I'm saying? So what I want you to understand is if I get into it, into a day trade, and I'm ready to get in and out. And I'm telling you, look, boom, we about to make some money here on the way in, on the way out. So check this out. Straight up. If I get in here and you're wondering, man, Keenan, where is your entry? Where is your entry? I told you the entry yesterday. Yesterday at 857 because you know I got the receipts always. You see what I'm saying? So, again, I'm here to teach you. Now, what a lot of people, what a lot of people want to do, and Sue, that's a great idea. Just use a stop loss, right? That's a great idea. Use a stop loss and even make even more money. That makes a lot of sense. Now, who doesn't like $100 bills? I love it. Now, again, what I want you to understand is this. Now, we expanded our mind where we say, okay, we making money. If it goes up, what are we going to do? And if it goes down, boom, what are we going to do? That's how we're rocking out, right? So we got our two strategies with specific lines that we're looking for. And we're looking for strength and we're looking for weakness. Now, you may be asking, what is strength? What is weakness? That's why I did the MACD video, the RSI video, to show you where the strength is and where the weakness is so you can see it for yourself because what happens is this i want you to be able to do this i don't want you to be able to be so dependent that if one day keenan isn't posting calls or posting videos or posting puts or nothing you don't know what to do what i try to do is make you independent so that you won't need anybody on youtube anybody on twitter anybody on facebook anybody on instagram all you're going to need is yourself now if you don't like that it is what it is the the real is not supposed to mix with the fake it's as simple as that it's not supposed to it's not supposed to happen you see what i'm saying so again what i want y'all to understand is i really want you to win i really want you to win and in the eyes of of those who just want to steal from you and get over on you then what will happen is they will steal from you and they will get over on you and then they'll make you lose and then they'll tell you that, boom, you know what? Hey, you lost because X, Y, Z when there was no straight up plan. I'm just here to teach you how to fish, baby. Teach you how to fish and then show you proof of concept. And I do it live. I will do it live. I will literally get into a trade live and show you how it's going. You see what I'm saying? And then get, check this out. If it's not going my way, I show you how to average down and then average out. Because remember, some people, all they want to do is just show you, look, I won here, I won here, I won here. But then when they lose, they have nothing to say, right? 
So I want you to really understand, right? Some want babysitters. It is, it is exactly that's, that's the case. That is really the case. Some people want babysitters, but we, we ain't having that, family. If you appreciate this, what I'm doing here, hit the like button for your boy. Straight up, family. Hit the like button. I appreciate you. Now, let's keep it going. And if you have not done so already, again, join the Discord. You know what time it is, baby. So then you can learn how to do what we're doing here. Now, another another thing that somebody said was, man, too, it, it was crazy. Keenan, why did you post your entry? I post my entry last night. What are you talking about? Right? I posted it last night. If I seen strength, if I seen weakness, they go to the entry right there. Boom. I did it on live. Right? I did the, I did the trade live. I can't do it no much more than that unless I call you up, right? Okay, cool. So now, let's keep it going. I show you that it could be done. Whereas some people, what they might do is tell you about it on YouTube, and then the next day, you waiting to get into a call, but the play is done, right? The play is done. So I really want you to understand that before anything else, really sit back and think, who is doing this live? Who is literally getting on live and actually trading an option and it could go up, it could go down, show you the levels, right? Show you the levels and then boom, literally play it. If it goes crazy, you make money. And if it goes down, show you how to get out of it and win it, baby. That's how we trying to rock out. So now let's keep it going. The overall stock market is pulling back. Look at this. This is VTI. We've been talking about this a lot. The overall stock market and shout out to y'all for hitting the like button. The overall stock market is pulling back like this. All the way down. What is this telling us? This is telling us that you're going to start to see a lot of fear in the market. So, what does this mean? We can make money on the puts. We can make money on the puts. But, guess what, family? Eventually, the market is going to turn back around. Now, if you've been watching the videos and watching education, you remember, like we talked about earlier, you look at that four-hour chart. What are you looking for? We are looking for this MACD level, this blue line down here, to cross over the orange and then stay over it. And then this will tell us that, okay, we're not just going to keep buying a dip, 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 buying a dip. And then guess what? We buy the dip and the dip keeps dipping. No, we're not trying to do that. We're trying to buy the dip when we know the dip is about to reverse and run up. That's what we're looking to do. So again, just know, I appreciate y'all for that. But now let's talk about something that we need to see. We need to see this. I really want you to screenshot this because somebody, somebody literally, I, yeah, I'm telling you, family, where my notepad? I got to get my notepad back because I, I moved it, but I got to get my notepad back. Bop, 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 somebody in the head with it. Check this out. Somebody criticized that we're talking about building out a foundation. What? What are you talking about? If you don't have a foundation, family, your portfolio and many of you, you'll be the judge. In 2021, was your portfolio on a roller coaster? Was it on a roller coaster? Now, if you have a strong foundation, your portfolio will not be on that same roller coaster, right? You see what I'm saying? So, you would be fine. And what I mean by foundation, I mean VTI, VOO, some type of dividend stock, right? Some type of just solid dividend stock that's been what they might call a dividend aristocrat. You said you said you had to for sure screenshot that. That's what I'm talking about. And then we got our individual stocks, our swing trades. Our options, so even if our swings and our options go to zero, you would still have, what, 10%, 5%. If that 15% right here goes to zero, you still got 85% of your money. And 80% of it is in bangers, and then 5% of it is in cash, so you would still be up. Family, come on now. It's straight up like that. So you know I got you. I always got you, and I appreciate y'all for hitting the like button too. But again... I'm telling you, I got to bring my notepad back. I moved it, and I, I'm telling you, bop, 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 I'm ready to, yo, come on now. Yep. Regal said a terrible roller coaster portfolio was on in 2021. And again, this year, we not having that. We not having that. So, again, if you want to see what I post to the watch list, and again, because there's another, there's, another there's another channel that I have on a Discord, and it's called Stocks of the Week. If I get into a longer term, let's call it option, Boom, I'll put that up there so we can all see it, right? We can all see it and we can all say, okay, this is where I'm establishing the position. This is where I'm starting it. But I want you to notice this. This NVIDIA option that I got in today, this $300, which could have been $3,000, what happened was this. I, and first of all, that was a great idea to just put a stop loss on it, right? Great idea. If you're about to sell out of it, why not just put a stop loss on it? Check this out. 
And, <laughs> Fluffy one, I appreciate you for the love, family. Let's go. What I want you to see is this happened in five minutes, maybe even three, maybe even three. So you trying to follow me literally like beat for beat on YouTube live, right? Or Discord live or however we do it. That's going to be a challenge, right? I know that's going to be a challenge. So guess what? You don't got to do it because this is what we do. I told you yesterday at night, if you see strength, we going here. If you see weakness, we're going here, literally down to the penny. So you could be all right. You understand what I'm saying? Mikey said the super chat don't work, family. They always playing with us straight up. They don't send the notifications out and you see what's going on too. Appreciate you. Anybody else down over 50% this year? I'm sure there are many people who are because now they have learned that they got to work on their portfolio. You see what I'm saying? You say your portfolio was up as much as 120% and now it's 35%. Nah, come on now. Straight up. Straight up. Can you make a video on stocks for custodial accounts? Just like this. VTI, VOO. Straight up. Just like that. A ETF. Keep it simple, right? You don't want to play games or take high risk when you're doing it for a custodial account. You want to keep it simple, right? Because you're not trying to trade that. You said you made 1200 with the same play? I got you, family. All you got to do is just listen. And guess what? I didn't have to call you up and tell you. You know what I'm saying? Now, I appreciate you for that. You said, and it actually created a channel the whole day. Let's go. Great info. I got you, family. I always got you. Okay. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get up out of here. I want y'all to, again, how do you make money on the way down? By doing this, you buy a put. But you got to understand what you're doing. And if you're looking for zones, you say you appreciate it. I appreciate y'all. Because just know, you can tell. I'm telling you. Sometimes, I tell you this all the time. I'm, I'm fun, but I'm not the one. Like, I get, when I feel like, I'm doing everything in my power to to pull you to the promised land. And then I notice that there are other people on the other side trying to pull us in the opposite direction, in the wrong direction. I'm not having that. And it, it frustrates me. It frustrates me. And, I, and I'm human. You know what I'm saying? I'm human. I get frustrated. Nobody's perfect. So what happens is I talk to you because I feel like talking to you is, is solid therapy for us, for you and me. You see what I'm saying? Why? Because you know what I'm thinking. You know... And, and, and it's just real, man. It's just real. And I always want to just keep it real with y'all all of the time because I see so much fake. I see so much fake out here and it's ridiculous. And I, I don't like it. I don't even want that energy in my space. You understand me? I don't, I don't like it at all. Now, somebody might do something like this where and, and those of you who are in the discord, I'm just going to I'm just going to talk to you. Those of you who are in the discord with me, shout out to y'all, my dogs. My dogs, understand, there are people who, and I'm not going to name drop or nothing like that, but there are people who are my peers in this space, on this YouTube thing, who, first of all, they might charge you $100, $1,000 or something like that to talk to them, to talk to them. And let's be clear, in order to talk to somebody who everybody wants to talk to at certain points, you might have to pay for that, and that's fair, right? However, I try to make it to a situation where you jump in the Discord, you could talk to me. It costs $5 to do that, right? It costs somebody else $100, costs somebody else $200, but I don't want to do that to you. I don't want to overcharge you, right? But I do, at the same time, want to be able to give you the best information I can give you, teach you how to do exactly what I'm doing and not holding back, not holding... Um, you know what? You can learn this at the $5 level. You can learn this at the $10 level. You can learn this at the $100 level. No, I teach you all. All you got to do is just join. That's as simple as that, right? So I'm not trying to upcharge. So then when people just be asking me like, yo, Keenan, why don't you call my phone so, so that when you do this, we could do this together. Man, get up out of here with that. You know what I'm saying? I got work to do. I got people to, I got people to help. I got to talk to the whole family when we having a conversation. You know what I'm saying? So again, make sure that you... You stand strong. You see what I'm saying? Stay strong. Do what you do. I appreciate y'all. And again, I, I'm telling you, this. I get so frustrated sometimes, but it is what it is. It is what it is. I, I can't let the toxicity be all in my system. So I try to shake it out by not holding it in. Never hold it in. Right? Always get it out. Be clear. Understand what's going on with that. And then you'll be okay. But again, I'm going to do another video. I'm going to let this one go. And I'm going to immediately jump back on. Right. So then we could talk about some other bangers. For example, I'm talking like just crypto and stocks in general. So I'm going to let this one go. 
And then, boom, we're going to come right back on it. I'm going to make a new thumbnail for that one. So then, boom, I'll catch you when I go do over there. But join the Discord if you want to be up and see the watch list when we post it, right? So then you can see it in advance and you know what to do when we show strength or you can know what to do when we show the weakness, right? Make sure you watch the MACD video that I posted earlier and all these other kind of things. But again, I got y'all. I see y'all. I'm going to post another video after this one. And again, I love y'all. But if you can't handle the heat of these hot stocks, then stay out of the kitchen. Consider investing in the index funds. Again, family, I see you in the next one. Take care.